the end of May, uh, we lost uh, a very significant figure in the Labor movement, uh, Dennis Nichols. He represented much of what has come to define the city of Newcastle. Started his working life as a fitter and machinist at the BHP Steelworks. He later became a union delegate and a senior union official. As a young man, he was a local rugby league legend, playing 111 first-class games of rugby league for the North Newcastle Blue Bags and developed a reputation for being a very tough front rower. Uh, the industrial politics of Newcastle in the 1980s were tough, but Dennis Nichols had a reputation for being fair and effective. He fought for wages and conditions and he fought to keep Newcastle's workplaces open. In 1983, he was elected as president of the Newcastle Trades Hall Council. He was elected to the Newcastle Council in 1986 and was deputy mayor between 1987 and 1989. Both his industrial and his political advocacy has shaped the city that Newcastle is today, particularly the Newcastle foreshore. I want to pay particular tribute to his leadership through the closure of the BHP Steelworks. At its peak, the steelworks employed 13,000 people and dominated the economy of the Hunter Valley. Its closure represented something larger than a massive loss of jobs. It was a threat to the identity of Newcastle itself. Dennis, through his leadership at the Trades Hall Council and his participation in the BHP Steelworks Transition Steering Team, was critical to ensuring that the end of the steelworks was not the end of Newcastle. He fought to give as many workers as possible a job or a dignified retirement. It was a difficult time for thousands of workers and their families, but Newcastle thrives today because people like Dennis fought for it. In 1988, he was the Labor candidate for the state seat of Newcastle, uh, and Dennis missed out because that was the election where Nick Greiner swept to power in a landslide uh, uh, that, uh, that put the Unsworth government out of office. I have to say, while uh, people would say I would say that, that Dennis would have been a very good uh, state member of parliament. Uh, he would have made a remarkable contribution as a state MP, and who knows, uh, he had a future as a future minister in a Labor government uh, and deputy, you know, very senior leader. He retired in 2001, but he remained committed to the people of Newcastle. He was the director of the Labor Cooperative Group. He was a senior leader uh, in Shortland Electricity and the Water Board. Uh, until his death, he was the chair of the Hunter TAFE Foundation, which financially supports TAFE students experiencing hardships. Uh, Dennis Nichols was a, uh, a very fair, decent, uh, fair-minded and honourable man whose, uh, whose leadership beyond uh, his own union for working class people in Newcastle made, the, made their lives better and made the region better. Dennis will be remembered by his local community in Stockton, to his wife Iris, his children and his grandchildren, our deepest condolences.